U.S. top diplomat Antony Blinken is on a multi-country West Asia tour in hopes of making efforts to end the Israel-Gaza conflict. This comes as Israel unleashed the most powerful bombing campaign in the 75-year history of its conflict with Gaza. After a solidarity visit to Tel Aviv, Blinken, on a six-nation tour of Arab countries, again defended Israel's right to respond, but also hardened his tone on protecting innocent Palestinians. Speaking alongside Qatar's Prime Minister, Blinken said that there can be no more business as usual with Palestinian militant group Hamas. There can be no more business as usual with Hamas. Murdering babies, burning families to death, taking little children as hostages, these are unconscionable acts of brutality. Every country, in our judgment, needs to condemn these actions, needs to hold them accountable. Blinken father praised Qatar, which has long-standing relations with Hamas for showing urgency in efforts to persuade the militants to free an estimated 150 hostages. Blinken arrived in Manama after stops in Tel Aviv and Qatar. He met with the Prime Minister and Crown Prince Salman bin Hamad al-Khalifa. Blinken expanded his trip from Israel and Jordan to include all of the Gulf Arab countries and Egypt, making it his largest tour of the region since taking office in January 2021. A day before Blinken met with Palestinian Authority President Mahmoud Abbas in Jordan, along with Jordan's King Abdullah, the Jordanian King, a longtime U.S. partner, called for humanitarian corridors to bring relief into Gaza and de-escalate the situation. Blinken promised to work with the Palestinian Authority and praised Abbas for efforts to maintain calm in the West Bank over the past week. Blinken's tour comes as the United States seeks to build pressure on Hamas while some U.S. officials work with Israel to establish safe areas where civilians could relocate and be safe from Israel's security operations. And for more on this, our correspondent um, Susan Tehrani is now sending, has sent us this report from New York. Susan, what do you have for us today? U.S. Secretary of State Anthony Blinken on Friday added another trip to his Middle East tour, Bahrain, as he and other American officials talked to allies hoping to secure the release of hostages being held captive by Hamas and through their intermediaries warn other adversaries of Israel like Lebanon's Hezbollah and Iran to not get involved in this war creating a larger conflict in the region. But Blinken's trip comes as Iran's foreign minister is also on a tour of the Middle East meeting with Iran's allies including the leader of Hezbollah, Sayyid Hassan Nasrullah, in Beirut. Susan Tehrani reporting from New York for We On World Is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.